Today we're going to take a look at the A-Sight VR by ZoomMax, a low vision wearable device that can magnify things around you. Hi everyone, it's Carrie from Live Accessible and I make videos on technology and encouragement for people who are blind and visually impaired. If you're interested in that type of video, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you can be notified every time I upload a video. So here is the latest version of the A-Sight VR and so this is a headset that you do wear and it has a camera at the front and if you turn it around, this is the part where you're, you will be wearing and it has two lenses here that you look into toward the screen and it shows what the camera is showing and from there you can magnify, you can change the color filters and the contrast. What really impressed me about this device is that it has a 48 megapixel camera. So even when I went to the highest magnification level, it was still very detailed and very clear. And guys, I need a lot of magnification and sometimes I'm using the maximum magnification. I had no problem using it with the a -Sight VR. But more on that later. First, we'll talk about the device, how it works, everything it can do. And then at the end, I will share my thoughts, how it worked for me and for my son who is three, turning four who's also visually impaired. And we also have a coupon code for you and some information on some educational discounts from ZoomX. So again, this is a VR headset. So once you have this on and you're using it, that's pretty much all you'll be seeing just through the VR headset, through those lenses and through using the camera. You won't be able to use any peripheral vision if you have any. So they do recommend that you don't go around walking with this, but it is really great for things like reading in the classroom, doing art, looking at fine details, or even watching TV because of how good the camera is and because how smooth it is as well as the 60 degree screen and the screens being full HD 1080p. It does a really great job with those tasks. But before we dive in more about this product, let me show you what comes in the box. So in the box, it comes with this very nice zippered case. And here is the A-Sight itself. And it also comes with the remote. This controls the whole device. And it also comes with a very nice hard shell case for the charging cables. And it also comes with a user manual. So let's get more into the device. So the A-Sight is very similar to other VR headsets there. It has three-point system for the strap. So one coming from each side, one coming from the top, and you these are completely adjustable. And it also has cushions on the front where you put your face to it. And on the very top in the middle, it has a focus dial. So this helps you focus onto the screen farther or closer to you. And then there is the charging port on the side. And here um, it uses a USB type C connector, which is great because you can reverse it and you don't have to worry about the correct direction that you plug it in. The battery life on the device is around two to three hours continuous use or you can also use it while it's plugged in. Then you have some controls here at the top. The first one is actually a release slide so you can remove the device from the headset. The next one is the power on. So if you press and hold this, this will power it on or off completely, but you can also just do a quick press and it puts it to sleep and then a quick press and it wakes it up. And if you leave it somewhere on a table, it should automatically turn off after a few minutes for you. And after the power button, there are two arrow keys and this uh, just helps when you need support from ZoomX if something's going on with your device. This is the remote control that controls all the functions of the device and to turn this on, you want to press and hold that bottom button and it should pair automatically to your device. The remote uses two AA batteries. It has a joystick and when you move it up, it zooms in and when you move it down, it zooms out. So now I have the A-Sight VR on, so that way you guys can see what I'm seeing. So I'm going to look around here of my living room and I'm going to zoom in over here all the way and you can see the details of the cushions that we have on our sofa. 
and so you can zoom out. And here I have the Acite VR user guide and I'm going to open up to a random page and right here we're going to take a look at it. And here you can zoom in again and you can press that bottom button on the remote and change the um, color filters. So it has white on black, black on white, yellow on black, black on yellow. After the regular color filter modes, it shows you an outline mode. So this is the white on black outline mode. And so you can see outlines here and you can actually increase or decrease any of the color filters or the outline modes by going left and right with the joystick like that. And so right here, you can actually see the outline of my phone and the ring light that I'm using to record this video. And then you have the black on white. And then this one, this has color, but it puts, um, it still uses an outline. So that just adds contrast to whatever you're looking at. Another thing that you can do is while you are reading and you are in a color filter, if you press that middle button one time, it'll take you to the color mode. And if you press it two times, it'll take you to the color mode and to the minimum zoom. The A site also has another button, which is at the top part of the remote. I usually uh, press this with my index finger and then the joystick, I usually use my thumb for it. Um, and this one, if you do a quick press, it takes a picture. From there, it freezes the image and what you can do is you can press and hold that trigger button and zoom in. And then you can pan around using the joystick. So if you wanted to read it in this way, instead of having to hold the piece of paper. The other function that the trigger button does is if you are zoomed in pretty far to a piece of paper or anywhere, and you press and hold that trigger button, it will activate the find feature. Uh, you can find what you want to magnify and put it into that red rectangle. And once um, you have it where you want it, you release the trigger button and then it'll zoom in. This also works when you're looking at something in your environment. So for right now, I'm looking at the phone, but I want to see what's around the phone. So I just press and hold that. And now I can see the light and I can see the tripod next to it and I can see where the phone is and that way I can get a better idea of everything around it. Now there are some settings you can change on the A-Sight VR and to get to those settings, you want to press and hold that top button on the remote that's right under the joystick. So you press and hold that and you can get to the settings. And from there, you can set your default zoom then you can change the brightness of the screen and then you can enable and disable color filters. For example, if you're, you never use the black on yellow or the yellow and black, you can disable those and that way when you cycle through all the different color filter options, you don't need to cycle through the ones that you don't use. The next one is a really interesting one because it allows you to change the size and position of the image. So if you go into that setting, what you want to do is press and hold hold that trigger button down and then move the joystick up and down to zoom in or, and zoom out of the image. And then from there, you can release the trigger button and then move with the joystick and that way you can move the image to a certain spot on the screen. This is really helpful for people that have a blind spot or who can see better in a certain area of their vision. The last option is to just reset all the options to factory settings. Now let me share a little bit of my thoughts on the A-Sight VR. Honestly, it was a really great experience because of the camera and the image quality of the device. I could really magnify and use it to its full magnification and I had no problems. And because of the way my vision works, 
I need something to be bigger, to be closer to it. So because of the screen size, the image size, and it being closer to my eyes, that really helped me be able to use it. So yes, it did work for me, this one did. And it did for my son as well, who is visually impaired like me and has aniridia. So here's a little bit of little Pablo's experience using the A-Sight. Okay, here we go. Hi, my name is Pablo. What do you think about the A-Sight? Good. It makes me more see. It helps me see better. What do you know on the control? I know how to make a picture and how to go out of this. Thing I'm making a picture of and I know how to make it bigger and smaller and change the color. Do you like it? Yes, I like it. I was able to teach little Pablo how to use this device. I just taught him how to magnify and change the color filters and even do the freeze frame with the remote and he was able to get it and it was really simple and easy. Now I will say that the A-Sight VR doesn't have all the features um, that some other wearable low vision devices have. They, it doesn't have a screen reader that tells you what magnification level or color filter you're in. It doesn't have facial recognition or optical character recognition where you can take a picture and it'll read back to you. But what it was designed for and what it is able to do, it does really well. And I think it really excels in that. And it's just really easy and simple to use. And it's also one of the most affordable wearable low vision devices out there at only $2,500. If you're interested in getting one, I do have a coupon code for you. It's Carry C-A-R-R-I-E, and you can call them or order online using that coupon code and you can get 10% off and I believe free shipping as well. Again, it's Carry C-A-R-R-I-E. That coupon code should be good until October 21st and they do also have educational discounts for students and that's good until September and they have some discounts on different bundles with the A-Sight and other portable video magnifiers by Zoomax. And I will leave all of the, that information and links down in the description. So again, a big thank you to Zoomax for sending out this demo unit so I can show all of you guys. I wanna hear from you. What do you think about this device? What do you think about wearable low vision devices in general? And what are you interested in seeing in upcoming videos. Is there a specific device or product that you'd like me to show on the channel? Leave that in the comments below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up below and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell for more videos on technology and encouragement for people who are blind and visually impaired. Thanks for watching everyone and I will see you in the next video.